anybody to be here. So today's video is gonna be lots of fun with no idea. Okay, so if you follow me on Instagram earlier today, um, I posted a video of a store that had lots of candy. That store is amazing. So before we get into the candy part, um, today's video is gonna be about pack design. Pack design is very important when it comes to graph design. Um, sometimes we buy stuff based on the packaging only. And I'm guilty of doing that. I do it all the time. So today I'm going to talk about, we're going to, I'm going to show you some pack design that I think is really cool. Now, in getting to the candy part, I think candy has the best pack design there is. Especially like classic, old school candy. Not like the one we have today, like Skittles and stuff. No. I'm talking about the classic, old school candy has the best pack design that ever was, I think it does. And some new school kind of stuff as well. See, I grew up in the 90s, I was born in the 80s. So candy and during those times, I think it really cool. That made me sound so old, but I'm not. Anyway, so candy pack design is the best. So I found this store in the Lower East Side here in New York City called Economy Candy. Let me show you. This is Economy Candy. They are a store that sold, that sells Old school candy, classic candy, stuff like candy that's like your grandmother ate, which I, which is, I think is the best candy ever. And I went there today and I bought some stuff showing based on pack design and really cool pack design that they had, but it's all candy. So I bought some stuff, the bag is full of stuff. So we're going to go through the candy and we're going to, going to taste some of the candy as well while we're talking about it. And we'll talk about the pack design and the packaging the paint comes in because I think those are things that people buy that's selling because design is more just like printing and websites. It's also pack design. Things you buy, things that what track you in stores, what sells. Okay, so when I went to Economy Candy, I bought so much stuff, but not really so much stuff. The store store was expensive. That was like $1.99, 99 cents. The highest I spent it was like $2.99. Like, it's not expensive, but it's really good stuff. So we're gonna go through the bag. And we're going to look at some packing designs and we're going to see what there is. Now we're going to do my favorite stuff first. See, that group in the 90s, candy was always like a fun treat. And let's see when it came in cool looking stuff. I loved it. So we're going to go with my favorite first. Now, if you were a kid, you probably remember these. Remember ring pops? I don't know, whoever designed ring pops. It's amazing that you put candy on a ring. Like it's like edible jewelry. The design of it is amazing. And that the actual the candy is shaped like a diamond kind of thing, I think. And I it out. Ah, okay. It's ring, it's amazing that these are ring pop. This is the flavor is cherry lime. It's a limited edition version of it. There's so many ring pop flavors, like I couldn't choose which one it was and it had so many my part open. And it's only so many that I wanted to know it's good. I want to have taste. Oh, this is so cool. Look at that. That's so cool. I love it. It's like a little disc. See, I'm already married. This could be my next ring. My husband wants to give me a ring pop. It's a ring. I would love it. Look at that. The ring pop. What does it taste like? Hmm, it's pretty good. Let me eat cherry. So, see, candy pack design is it's amazing. See, when you buy stuff, we buy stuff based on, like, well, I do, most some people do too, based on design, and the, you think of the design, it's not just the candy, it's the design of candy, like, someone took time to figure out how to, what to achieve this, how to make, how it's going to sell, because how things look are very important to getting sell, so when your client asks you to make something that you want, that needs to be sellable to a market, think about candy, think about what attracts people to their eyes, because this is attractive, this is what kids attract, and kids are best People to get attracted to get um to buy stuff from. This is amazing. Candy pot, it's a little ring pop. I love these things. See ring pops. And the thing is like it's the ring, but the lot light pop is on a ring. I love it. Okay, so let's see what's next. Now I also another favorite of mine are pet dispensers. See when I was young I used to have one of these, but I've never too big in them, but oh, this came out by itself. Okay, so this is now this is a recent one. This is the movie Monsters Inc. I think it's from a movie, and the pegs are pegs. Here's the pegs. Pegs, a little candy. It's 
At first, I always loved the Pegs logo. See the Pegs logo? It looked like Pegs itself. And it's really, really good. So we're going to put one in the Pegs dispenser and see how it works. It's, I love this stuff. It's like, I don't know, Haiti is so much fun. And you can look at it, you can keep it too. See, it's like, it's pretty good. Strawberry. Okay, so let's put it in the peg dispenser. Move the peg's head. There we go. See, the head pops open like this. See, this is good. It's, it's cheap, but it's good design. Like, and you put the peg in the slot. See, it pulls up. Goes up. Hold on. Okay, this is a long way to take. Okay, get it. But you put the peg in the heater and slide down, and when you open up the head up, it popped up. See, easy design, simple design, but very, very popular and easy to do. I love it. Now, it's not good one. I'm going here. Oh, this is good. Yeah, everybody remembers, everybody remembers bubble tape. See, remember tape like. Scotch tape, but really it's bubble gum. And you open it on the side. There we go. And it's gum! Look at that! Hmm. It's bubble gum. This is a genius. I think this is why I love bubble. This is why I love Papaka design. Because things like this are genius. This is so cool. I love it. It's I love it. And it's so easy and fun to look at. Let's open it again. Look at that! I love it. Okay, that's bubble tape. It's so much fun. It's dropped on the floor, but it's okay. <laughs> okay. Next one is... Oh, this is cool. This reminds me of my husband. My husband's a huge Transformer fan. So, they had these mints that were Septicons from the Transformer. They're, they're sour cane, too. They're called, they're called Septicon Berry Sours from Transformers. And the case is Transformer. I may give this to him as a gift because he's seen it already, but I may give it to him because it's very cool. What do they taste like? That's true. Oh, they're already wrapped up too. Okay. <laughs> the funny thing is, they're blue. So, you know what a blue pill you don't get going with that. Put this to the top of my mouth. Let's see. They taste like I'm still eating the pears right now in my mouth. Okay. Oh, even the pill, even the pill, sorry. Even the candy has a little septicon logo on it as well. You can see that or not. It may not, but it has a little septicon as well on it. So let's see. Oh, okay, they're a little bit sour, but the, but the packaging, the point here, is pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I think it's all design. That's great. I think it's great for the candy. It's almost like a superhero or action figure. Or actually, weak fan. It's great to have. That's cool. See? I'm sorry, this store is amazing. There's so much stuff in this store and Kanye candy. There's more. I just bought some stuff. This is more. And then, oh, my other favorite here. Oops, if I just swallow that. Sorry. Or our nerds. Remember, nerd? I know. I love these all the time. See, think about this thing. This is. This gave people an option. This package design, the way they did it was smart. So I feel like. I gave people options. It's like, if you felt like you wanted some sharp, some seriously strawberry side one day, you just open the side peel here, to open the slap here one side. So why was I going to open this up today? Let's see. Mm -hmm. You open one side. Ah, I'm going to kill it here. Okay, there's directions here. I should be following directions on this thing, but I'm not following directions. There we go. Okay. There we go. One side. See? You open one side. The strawberry, seriously, side. Maybe you want money, you want some strawberry snurs. See? I'm not good. And then the other side one day. Remember, if like tomorrow, if you want some more, if you're having, you know, gotta have a grape day. It's like a grape day, then you get some grapes. Some grape side nerds. Great. You have options on both sides and they separate it. 
So it's a good design for this. Good design for people who don't want to mix their candies together. I think some people don't like mixing candies because the taste gets weird. Depends on the candy. The only bad thing about the design is that it's not really good. Like, he yeah, had trouble. Like, I just had trouble opening this. It rips easily. Like, see, I like tore it apart already. But that's the only bad thing about the nerd's candy package design. It's the only bad thing about that design. But overall, it's pretty good. Now, this I've never seen before. And the next one I've never seen before, because, but it's really cool. If you're a video gamer and you love video games and you love candy, this, and this thing was only $2.99, so this is amazing. Look at this. It's a Pac-Man candy. It's Pac-Man. This is, if you're a, this is awesome. I'm, I, I don't know what kind of candy is in here, so I'm going to open it and see what it is. But I thought this was so cute. So I even had the buttons inside a actual game of Pac-Man inside there. Let's see. See? That is awesome. So let's see. Let's open it up and see what's inside of here. It opens from the bottom. This is kind of weird, but looking for the bottom. Yeah, it opens from the bottom. There we go. See? Open from the bottom. And inside. Oh, it's Pac-Man candy inside. And the candy's being shaped like Pac-Man. This is amazing. Look at this. It's not a lot of candy here. It's not a lot. But is it a lot of candy? Oh, that one. Okay, see inside this a block. is a little Lock inside that stuff. I think this is the top of it here. But this is the candy that's in it. Oops. That was work. And the candy is yellow, just like Pac Man package. But let's see. See, it shaped like Pac Man. And it tastes like. Not bad. Simple. But, okay, it's a little powdery because that's got my nose. But, that doesn't have, have much taste to it, but the pack is like, excuse me. The pack is, is great. See? I love this so adorable. And the top and the bottom part. It's great. See it? You put it back on. The little Pac Man. That is so cute. I love it. I remember Mrs. Pac Man. Mrs. Mrs. Pac Man. People thought they got married. <laughs> okay. Now the next one. And no, another favorite of mine is Buzz Pops. You know what this? This is like the ultimate live pop. This is like the mega live pop. This is like live pops, live pops all. But in the organized live pop because it was in the organized container. And the push pick is this might be a highlighter. It looks like a highlighter a little bit to me. This looks like a highlighter for me a little bit. Or a pen or kind of marker. This is really cool. And you open it. And there's the push bulb. See? You gotta push it down though. Take the wrapper off the top. See, this design, packet design is pretty good, but sometimes it gets a little messy, but see, okay, that doesn't want to stay down, but that's the push pinkle. That's the candy part right there. See, so put it back in the top. Let's see. Mix it now. Let's see. Yeah, okay, so that's a light pop. That's the candy part, but usually, I think the spring here is broken. But that's a light pop. It's cherry flavor. It's very strong cherry flavor. So, next candy is. I have here. Oh, this is really cute too. I know this is the first time I've seen this too. You know, Hello Kitty is huge in, in Japan. So, there is a Hello Kitty mint box. But the box is just shaped as the Chinese. Chinese Chinese take out order carton you buy when you buy Chinese food. But the thing is, this is kind of not because I think, I think how Kitty's eight Japanese or Chinese. I don't think she's Chinese, she's Japanese, I think, or Korean. So I'm not sure which one part of Asia is part of it. But this, the package, but well, the package is cool. It's like a little Chinese take out box. This is awesome. Let's see what's inside. Let's take it open, open it up, and see. The candy itself. I thought this was too cute. I'm, I'm just know all these ten boxes I'm keeping for like over other stuff. And look, oh, the candy's little stars. Look at that, little stars. Let's see. Oh, the candy is little stars. They're supposed to be mints. I think they're mints. Are they mints? They're. It says lucky star candy. 
this is lucky star is it your luck i don't know what do you just say that <laughs> let's see let's see what they taste like it's lucky star or something like that hmm okay i don't like flavor but they're pretty good lucky star look at this this is too cute though like a little tin, like a little Chinese box, my Chinese food take out. That's too cute. I'm gonna keep that as well. That's adorable. See, this, this is the kind of stuff this kind can have a lot. Just, the store is packed full of stuff. And this is one though. Let's see what's in here I got today. Oh yeah, this is back to video games. Back to video design of candy. Atari, if you grew up in the 80s, you know Atari. It has look, it actually moves. This is like a controller for, for Atari. So let's see, what's the candy in here? And this is, oh, this is gum. This is, and they call it Atari fruit flavored gum. So let's see. I'm gonna open it up and see. So I recommend, I really recommend you go, if you live near your city, go check out a Kami candy because this place is really cool. If you're like a person who likes fun stuff and fun pack of design and candy too, this is really cool to go to. I really recommend it. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Tari flavored gum. And the pack design is kind of open, but it looks really cool. Oh wow, it's like chiclets or trident gum. The little white pieces, they're like trident gum. Okay, see what they like. It's like Trident. Yeah, you know, it's really Trident. That's what it is. But, oh, now she knows not like Trident. This is like strawberry. Oh, it's really good. Oh, it's okay. It's, it's, we bite into it all in flavor. But, package is made. It's so cute. It's totally old school. This is real old school. Love it. Okay. And, next to the last one. If you're a Wii video game person, see, I, I got a video game. Um, um, it seems like those are the best ones. I saw when I, like, when I look at Patrick's on in the store. Those ones attract me most, I thought. I thought they were really cool. This is, you know, Wii controllers. You know, remember, you play like Wii tennis, like, psh, psh, psh. And you play the book just and knock towards someone's like, lamp in your house, and you're like, sorry. But this is the Wii controller, the Wii candy. Let's see. It's actually oh, it's gum elves, oh, gum balls. There must be small balls in here. So let's see. And this is so cool. And it has the buttons on it as well. Like there's the, the control button and they you know they only work. And the power button that's is really cool. Okay, so let's see. Oh wow, it's actually real gum balls. Oh, this is awesome. Look at that. This is in the Wii controller package. This is so cool. Okay, I'm gonna eat this into my gum, my Atari gum. But it's actually composed big gumballs. That is so cool, it's inside of that. And this is the cover. This was Atari, this is the Wii. That's so cool, there's gum, gumballs in here. That's awesome. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Hope oh, you yeah, had fun. I had a lot of fun eating those candy. And I'm not gonna eat all, I'm gonna say some of it. Um, pack of design is amazing. Pack of design is very important. We got design, it can be fun. You can make it into candy like this one and like this one. So this I hope you enjoyed this. Because pack design, it can be great. It can be very fun to look at, it can be very good design. People who make pack design as a, as a career as, as designers do very well and they enjoy their job probably because make you can make fun of things. Could be people we buy stuff based on how it looks sometimes by appearances. We may not know what's in it, we may know what it does, but by looking at it, it attracts the eye, it makes you get drawn to it. And this pack of design is all about get people to look and say, Oh, I want that, based on how it looks. And there's a lot of things in design is like that. That's your pack of design. So, this is a good example of it. Things like this, so people can take popular things from the past and make it into packages and contain it with sweet little candies. So, hope you have fun in this video. If you have fun, and I'll see you next time.